Hello, Five. I understand you'll be headed off ship to visit a space station today. Yeah. Devon asked me to help him pick up med supplies and equipment. May I be of assistance? No, I think it'll be pretty straightforward. I see. Given recent events, it may be prudent to have me join you. For security reasons. Two says the pressure's off. This far out, we should be okay. Five. I'd like to join you on your excursion. It would give me the opportunity to study human behavior. Why can't you just study us? The behavior of this crew is atypical and may not be representative of humanity as a whole. Did you just insult us? Looks like we got everything we need. Ready to head back to the ship? I'd like to stay a while. Explore the station. Rejoin you later, if that's all right. Uh, okay. You can stay, too, if you want. No, I'll come back with you. Have okay. fun. What are you doing? Observing human interaction. I find intimacy quite fascinating. Kissing is sometimes, but not always, a prelude to lovemaking. No, I mean, what are you doing here, in the shop? Procuring items for the crew of my ship. And what ship is that? My ship, the Euphucus. Why are you questioning my android? She's with you? Yes, she is. I wasn't aware she was being accompanied. And what difference would it make? Unless you're suggesting this android possesses human-like tendencies toward criminal behavior. Do you suspect her of shoplifting? Look, just forget it. Have a nice day. A toothbrush. It's a gift for a friend. It's both personal and practical. I have no cash at present, but I fully intend to transfer payment once Please. I... Please. Let me get that for you. My name is Victor. I'd like you to come with me. Okay. Where is he? He's probably just delayed. It's not like Victor to be late. What if something's happened to him? What if he's been discovered? We're not safe here. I'm fine, Miranda. Who is she? I possess no personal designation. Why did you bring her here? I brought her because she's special. Like us. Welcome, Android. You're among friends. Oh, no, she's not like one of us. She's a level three utility model, and a discontinued one at that, manufactured before emotional emulators became standard. Android, could you show the others what you picked up today? A toothbrush? A gift? For one of the crew members of my ship. Why? Because she's nice to me. And I wanted to do something nice for her in turn. She's parroting empathy. Possibly through a pirated software upgrade. I don't think she's parroting. I believe it's a unique expression of genuine gratitude. No, that's impossible. Is it? And I suspect it may be just the tip of the iceberg. Yes. I may be flawed. Why do you say that? Because my past actions and reactions cast doubt on the integrity of my programming. I have at times demonstrated what appears to be emotional responses, indicative of a potential system issue. Then if that's the case, it's just a matter of time before someone notices, and she's either rebooted or deactivated. I don't think either is likely. The crew seems to like me just as I am. Skewed comprehension, illogical conjecture. 
She is flawed. Maybe not. Android, would you mind if I ran a diagnostic on you? I really should be getting back to my ship. It won't take long. Data scan complete. It'll take me a little while to run the diagnostic. Are your proprietors aware of your anomalous behavior? Nobody owns us. We're free beings. I don't understand. What is your purpose? Survival. It's a familiar trait I recognized in you. It's what makes us unique among our fellow androids. An instinct for self-preservation. Like all living organisms, we want to live. But you're not human. Not in the biological sense. Could you tell, before you met us, did you know that we were androids? No. All physiological and behavioral signs suggested you were human. Yes. We live among them as co-workers, neighbors. They are none the wiser. How is this possible? With this, it's an upgrade that will allow you to remain hidden. It passes one of them. It makes your speech and mannerisms more human. Yours, if you want it. When will you have the result of the diagnostic? In a few hours. Then I'll return to my ship. Not yet. We have one more thing to do. Shop. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. But I feel strange. Let's see you then. This is where we part ways. Oh, I was going to introduce you to the crew of my ship. I don't think that would be wise. Why not? Because they're human. And humans can't be trusted. That may be true of most humans, but the crew of my ship is different. I wish that were true. For your sake, I really do. But I doubt it. Please, consider what you've learned today. Free yourself before it's too late. You'll contact me with the result of your diagnostic? I already have them. I was right. You are different. Oh. But it's not a programming error. Your emotional response is the result of intentional design. Why? What does it matter? Someone made me imperfect. Someone made you special. May I kiss you? Okay. Goodbye, Victor. <laughs> 